go through us. The season's first meeting between Waterford and Stonington was a two-point double overtime win for the Lancers. Wednesday's rematch in the ECC semifinals would also come down to the wire. The Lancers got out to a seven-point lead in the second quarter when Matt Irvine picks up a loose ball and hits Devontae Valentine on the break to make it 20 to 13. Stonington would come right back to tie it, with Will DeFanti finding Sam Donahue for the lay-in. With the score tied again at 33-33 in the third quarter, Gary McLeod gets a steal and takes it the length of the court. McLeod would then pick off a long pass and connect with Valentine, putting Waterford up 40-33. Stonington would come back again, though, with Cody Candelette hitting a three-pointer to cut the margin to 43-41 at the end of the third. Tied at 50, with three and a half remaining in regulation, the teams matched each other blow for blow, with baskets by Nolan Long, Donahue, McLeod, DeFanti, Pat Rogers, and Jake Berkowitz. A free throw by Long gave Waterford a one-point lead, with Stonington controlling the ball with 12 seconds left. The Fanti's basket made the score 60-59 to with 4.5 seconds remaining. He's the first guy to, to compliment everybody else. You know, he, he made the shot, but it was because Logan set the screen, Cody made the pass, you know, Jake hit the big shot a couple, you know, a minute earlier. Um, he was the first guy to give the credit to his teammates. I don't think it's on my shoulders at all. I think that it's on everyone. I think all the way down the bench. It's not just me that makes all the contributions. It's everybody. Waterford had one last chance for the win. But Irvine's drive was just off the mark. Stonington will face undefeated New London in the championship on Friday. Do you have a shot? I think so. I told Chris Dunn that I wanted him. I wanted a piece of them. And I, think, I think that we're the only team around this area that can beat them. Because I think we're the smarter team and we know how to play against them.